Hello. Today, in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to teleport with ore. Now, if you're playing on a server with uh, multiple people, this will be slightly more tedious, but also not very much more tedious. Uh, as you know, with ore and other items that have this icon at the top, uh, you cannot actually go through any portals with it. It says an item prevents you from teleporting. However, if you log out, go to your main menu, you hit start game, choose the character that couldn't go, choose a world, any world that isn't the world that you were just in, you hit start through the loading screen. I will like to let you know that this requires at least 20 wood, and it could be as extravagant as you want, or as simple as you'd like, but at the very least you need enough wood to make a workbench and a chest. The no, uh, Valheim is Terraria, but it's a little bit different. It's Terraria and Minecraft. So it's like Terraria, where you can have multiple characters on multiple worlds, and you can switch your characters between worlds. So here, we have our slightly extravagant base that is offline. Nobody else can join this because it's in my single player world. I'm gonna do some quick repairs. And you see we put the silver ore into this chest. Then, if we log back out, and uh, I'm connecting via a dedicated server, so I'm going to connect via Steam. It'll push me in. I'll select the same character. Going through the loading screen, it'll ask me to type the password again because uh, I have no idea. Early access games, I guess. And after a quick loading screen, it's actually surprising how little a solid state actually does for your loading times. You see that we can, in fact, go through portals. And now you're probably thinking, well, you can't just like get the ore, it's not on your character anymore. And if you tell it, and if you go back to a different world, you'll just appear somewhere else. Here we have a chest with nothing in it. And our portal still works. Still allows us to go through it. I'm going to log out yet again. Now if we hit start game and select our offline world again. This could you could select another server although it's more efficient to do it offline because you know how uh, you know that nobody can affect the world while you're away from it and you know that no uh, no mobs can show up while you're away because uh, nothing is moving when the world is unloaded we're here back in our world we can open our chest the silver's still there now we can go back out of the world also, this is beautiful weather to be doing this video in. I just want to say that. Beautiful weather. Now, oh, gotta load via the server again. Start. It's going to ask us our password. And now, once we have loaded, we will have successfully teleported ores without using a boat and without really cheating, just kind of taking advantage of how the game works. As you can see, we're back here, but we have ore, there's nothing in the chest, and now there's eight ore. And just to show you that I'm not using mods or anything, I still cannot go through this portal. The ore does prevent me from going through it. it doesn't prevent me from breaking the rules of physics, though. So yeah. So they decide to fix this, that's just how it works. Fixing it will be quite difficult, so I doubt they will fix it quite soon. Um, but until they fix it, you can uh, you can use it to your advantage. 